nice one guys so welcome back in the kitchen with another one um i'm gonna show you exactly how to do this recipe this evening you know what i mean sometimes i may suffer with from a little bit of cold and flu and all them stuff there so this evening we are here to share a uh, beautiful recipe i even start to prep some of my ingredients already to show you how serious chef ricotta is at the moment with this one okay yeah um on my youtube channel as soon as i get my like up to 20 then i will start the show all right 20 like and i'm very grateful for that all right guys yeah let's get the like up to 20 we're going five 20 like and then we are good to go okay so if you're just coming under the show show some love all right let's get the like up to 20 guys all right we're gonna be making an yeah 11 yeah thank you so much i appreciate that love all right yeah we're gonna do something before you go to bed tonight i know it is friday night a lot of people might just come from work and they're warm and feel like they're one of us um we got 15 thank you so much let's get it to 20 that's 20 like and i'm good to go yeah happy friday evening guys i hope you guys are having a lovely evening um yeah please share the video to your family to your friend to your cousin to your niece 21 like thank you so much i appreciate my youtube channel your people are amazing i think you're an angel man um yeah please share the video big up my youtube um my facebook audience thank you so much guys happy friday evening and we're just gonna be making a nice little um um home remedy which you can use at home to you know make yourself some nice lovely um tea all right yeah so what you want to do is make sure you have all of these ingredients right here so we got one two three four secret ingredients um uh, i did this many times you know sometimes i show you exactly how to do this one all right i just share thank you so much um please share the video guys that's that's the beautiful thing you need to do if you want to do something good for someone, let's share the video and tell a friend and a friend to a friend. All right. Let's share the video. Share the video. Thank you so much. Good evening, Q. Q, man. Q, man. Thank you so much. Cherry, thank you so much. All right. Now, so we got some turmeric, ginger, garlic, and lemon. Now, these ingredients, guys, they are amazing. We're going to add some cloves to it because I like to have cloves. All right. Yeah. We're going to add some cloves to it. Definitely. 100%. All right. Um, Brenda, thank you so much for coming on the show. Good evening, Brenda. Thank you so much. My biggest follower. Here's the Zim. Thank you so much for coming on the show. I appreciate the love, man. 100%. Thank you so much. All right. Now, if you want to do something good, please share the video and tell a friend and a friend tell a friend because this video is going to be a very important video which you want to try and make at home. Enough love, my brother. Respect, my brother. Thank you so much for coming on the show. All right. So what this would do, and I mean, sometimes you feel your body sore. Sometimes you feel like you're going to have a little bit of cold. Sometimes you feel like you're going to have a little bit of sore throat. Sometimes you feel tired. Sometimes you head hurt in you. These are some remedy which I'm always sharing with you and say, um, try this kind of home remedy at home. All right. And I'm going to show you how to make it and do a nice, lovely cup of tea. So right now, if you are watching, go in your kitchen and grab yourself a few ingredients and watch. You may not have the fresh ingredients like what I have, but yeah, we're still going to make something tonight. All right. So go in your kitchen and grab yourself um a few ingredients <clears throat> all right now the first thing we're going to need to do right over here all right just to make sure you guys can see what's going on because i want you guys to see we're going to get this is my stone brenner right here i love it man so that's the first thing we're going to do i got some turmeric just don't do what chef ricardo been doing cut it on a piece of a board all right guys yeah Please cut in a piece of board. But just be careful when you're cutting the tumor because the tree is so yellow. You just 
yell up your whole cotton board and stuff. So this is what I normally do. I just rest it on a piece of a napkin or something and cut it because it's really stainy. All right. So what you want to do, you want to um, crush. You need to crush these ingredients right here. Okay, so we're gonna crush it to show you. You may hear a little bit of thing or um, like things made a, you know, drop out and fall out. All right. So that's what's happening right there when you crush the turmeric. So that look nice yeah that's turmeric and this is the organic one all right the only problem i have right now a lot of people are gonna say chef ricotta can't get the organic one i know you can't get it because you know what i mean it take me two hours to go and drive this to get the organic one don't use curry powder please <laughs> well if you can just use the powder one until you can get the fresh one just use the powder one but please do not use curry powder. That's straight red flag. All right. Try and use this one. This is the powder one. Try and use the powder one if you don't have the fresh one. All right. All right. Look at that, guys. Wow. That's what they're talking about. Now we are going back to old school. All right. Uh, <laughs> you love the color? Yeah. Yeah, the color of it is amazing, man. Yeah. Now we're going to get some ginger. All right, let's get some ginger. And we're going to put some ginger inside of it. All right. We're getting a large portion of fresh ginger. All right, you might as a chef Ricardo, I cannot get fresh ginger. Well, the ginger powder, that's gonna be effective like the fresh one. You know what I mean? So you have to try and get the fresh one. But ginger sell everywhere now. You know what I mean? It's one of the most populous um, thing you can ever get. So we're gonna beat up the ginger. Look at this. Look at this, guys. So that look nice. That is amazing. Yeah. Um, that's what I'm talking about. You want to beat it up? See that? Yeah. That looking good. Now you have to be careful because turmeric is very yellow and it's just like very, very yellow, guys. All right, now we're gonna get some fresh garlic. All right, here it is fresh garlic. Garlic is very good for high blood pressure. All right, let's put that one side. One. Two. Three.
four. All right, that's what we there are doing now. Now you, you must share the video, guys. Don't, don't don't forget to do that one. We're gonna use five cloves of garlic. All right, guys. Look at that. Take a good look, guys. See that? Yeah. So what we're gonna do with the garlic then now? We're gonna cut up the garlic. Don't wash the garlic then, because you don't wanna kill the stain of the garlic. All right. You can just cut them up small. All right. Yeah. That's what Chef Ricardo doing right now. Very easy one, guys. All right. Very very easy and simple. All right. Yeah. It's nothing too complicated. So these are the garlic, five cloves of garlic. Yeah, yeah, so I'm gonna beat up the garlic now. Look at this. Nice to take out a teaspoon and put in some curry chicken or some curry lamb or some curry beef or you know. Now we're gonna get some lemon. No, some lime. Sorry, guys. All right. If you can get the organic one, get it, and do what Chef Ricardo gonna do. See how this look? So you wanna leave the white part on it. Don't take off too much of the white bit. And there's a lot of health benefit in the white bit. Recep art light. The seeds, you see this one I got the seed, this is the gourd one. All right, you see the seeds them? Do not remove the seeds them. Cut up the seeds also. All right, just cut up everything. Don't worry yourself about the middle bit. If the seed come out, take up the seed and put it inside of it. Cut it up finely. And let's put it straight inside of it like this. All right, look at that. As I say, you just have to be careful of the color. It will stain up your own kitchen. Beat up everything. All right. I'm going to get the rest. All right. Hope you guys can see what's going on. All right. Yeah. Beautiful. This is amazing, guys. Trust me. No, you can't get this to buy. No expensive supermarket in the world have this. This home remedy. None. You think they're going to give you this to take, guys? They're not going to make this for you to take it. All right? They want to make things to take your money, but not this one. God, this one is powerful. All right, guys. 
Yeah, then now I'm going to make this. Not even the pharmacy. Michibo. Thank you so much for coming on the show. All right, guys. None of these shop not going to give you this remedy. They sell, it, they sell the product, but they're not going to make this for you. Wow, this is too powerful. What they're going to say, we cannot sell this in the shop because we sell it. <laughs> you guys going to... Nobody not gonna get sick. <laughs> so they have to they have to um if they sell this one in the shop, nobody gonna get sick. Everybody gonna be just like nah man. So basically they have to sell a product for you to get sick. So in the supermarket, you won't get this one, guys. You have to make this at home yourself. Trust me, they're not now. What you wanna do? Get one of these containers. And scrape it out like this. Alright. Yeah man. Scrape it out like this. Yeah, in the supermarket, you're not gonna get this for buy. What they're gonna do. Alright, I'm gonna tell you what they're gonna do. They're going to take your money because they're gonna sell a product for you to get not to get better. Trust me. You cannot get this to buy. You have to make this. You have to spend some time at home and buy the ingredients them. And no supply. Yeah, I saw a chef for color make this. Here it is. Alright. Yeah. Very yellow, guys. All right, but trust me. You see, this is powerful, man. No, not only that. Let me, let me show you something now. You see, the juice, look at this juice. You see, this right here, let's use a teaspoon like this and squeeze it down. And this one right here, very good for you. Let's take a teaspoon of it. Mm. Ah, wow, man, that's amazing, guys. That is amazing. Mm -mm. Yeah, cover this, and this can last in your fridge for one week straight. Let's make a cup of tea. Wow, the juice is amazing. The juice, you see the juice? Wow, the liquid from this. We can all do the same thing like that. Make up a big large portion, strain it off, and just take a teaspoon every morning on an empty stomach for a week. Let's make a cup of tea. All right. So in the morning when you wake up, you can do two things. Either you boil your kettle, and then you, you do what I'm going to be doing right here now. And make yourself a nice, lovely cup of tea. All right. So I got a large cup right here. large cup because it's when you drink this you are drinking a large cup of tea all right let's get things cracking on nice one now here it is cloves all right this one i'm gonna make now is gonna be different so i'm gonna add some cloves to it Roughly about a teaspoon of cloves, all right, into the water. Cloves fight against infection and all them stuff there, guys. You know what is this? This is pimento seed. Put a few inside of it. to find my medicine up here don't tell me it is gone I'm not really happy if I cannot find it I'll find it you can use two things either black pepper or some cayenne pepper this is some cayenne pepper all right 
go inside of it. Roughly about quarter teaspoon of cayenne pepper into the liquid like this. So cayenne pepper will help to activate up the turmeric more. All right. You don't. You may not need to use so many like what I'm using, but I'm using a large cup. It's gonna be really spicy. All right. We're gonna get some bay leaf. All right, put some bay leaf into it like this. Three bay leaf is very good. All right. Now, so here it is. We're gonna get a remedy. As I say, you can't get this in the supermarket for buy because they won't be selling you this because if they sell you this, you're not gonna sick. One large teaspoon, put a little bit more because a large cup of water. Then, you know what I mean? So this is what you want to do. This is very good for sore throat. You see this right here? Very good for sore throat. Just take one teaspoon of this right here. So sometimes when you do it, once you wash your teaspoon and make sure your teaspoon is clean, you just go inside of it like this and take all a teaspoon in the morning. All right? Mm. Ah, that is amazing. Look at that, guys. Mm -hmm. You see it look? All right, yeah, here it is. Take a good look. Now, the information, guys, I will definitely put the information in the description box for the ginger and the turmeric and the garlic and the lemon. I got a lot of video on YouTube talking about those information or wow. the behind the the powerful behind the information with this. But right here, ninety nine point nine percent is very good for. You know what I mean? Like information in your body, which why enough of us are suffering a lot. All right? Because remember, you know, guys, these natural stuff do works at home. Turmeric, ginger, garlic, lemon, all of these things do work at home. Um, if you notice, most of my stuff that I put up, there's a little bit of information about it. What's the benefit for it? And that is coming from the health side. I try to get a lot of stuff from the health side because they are, they are very good. And I learn a lot from them. All right, so big up the L side. I have to give them support for that one. Um, so as I say, you can make this. Take one teaspoon every morning with a cup of tea, with a cup of hot water, and drink it for at least a five morning. All right, this helps to fight against cold and flu. Um, help you with your even high blood pressure. All right, um, your sugar level. Help to cleanse your body. Cleanse your, you know what I mean? This is very good for cleansing like parasite and all them stuff there you know sometimes we eat so many fruits we just go to the shop sometimes people just bite the fruits and not even wash it so yeah but this one right here is powerful guys very very powerful very good for the vein very good for the blood and you know what i mean turmeric also help to kill you can do your own research on that one turmeric is so powerful that it will even help to kill may even help to kill cancer cell so do your research on this one. Well, I'm not a doctor, but do your research. All right. Here it is. So it's boiling up. And that's looking good. Yeah. That's looking amazing. So you can do your own research on it, guys. But the turmeric is powerful. And the garlic is powerful. All right. So it's everything. I just add a few extra stuff. When you see I add in the pot, you do not need to put that. But that's me. I like to add less, a little bit more stuff to my tea when I'm making it sometime. All right? <coughs> um, sorry, guys. That's the, the prepper. All right. Let's turn off this one. Lovely. So we're going to put this one over here. Let's take it off the cooker. Because we're not cooking ox steel this evening. Alright. Yeah, but it's beautiful, guys. Yeah, it's a prepper of that now. You know, prepper make your 
I'm gonna make you sweat. So when you put, that's why I put a lot of cayenne pepper because that make you sweat. If you're suffering from any like cold or flu or you know what I mean, sore throat or anything like that. Um, you can put a little bit of honey, but me, I like drink it natural like this. All right, no honey. <coughs> that pepper is very strong. Ah, uh, the pepper is very strong, but I need it, guys. You know what I mean? Yeah, here it is. Yeah, that's looking good. Perfect. That looks amazing. You know what I mean? Yeah, put back some bay leaf inside of it. And also put back a few, a little bit of this inside of it, all right? <sighs> oh, the pepper is so strong. Oh, sorry guys, that's that pepper that's strong. Yeah, but when you drink this, yeah, I hate that man. When you drink this, wow, trust me. Any cold, any flu, anything come near you, it's gonna lick it out. All right, yeah. So this is what I'm talking about. But I put a portion of cayenne pepper in it. And trust me, it is amazing. So, <clears throat> that pepper is so strong because I put a lot of pepper in it. But now I want to try it myself and see how hot it is. It's not going to be really hot. Yeah, let's try it. Yeah, that's perfect. That's perfect. The only thing I need in that for myself. Oh my God, cloves gonna kill me off. Cloves, I like my cloves, man. I put a few cloves in it. Yeah. That is amazing. <clears throat> that pepper is so strong. All right. Now, I get some fine seed right here. I don't know if you guys know what is fine seed. I brought this one today. I saw it in the supermarket and I brought this one because I know this one is very good for weight loss. Fine seed. All right. So what I'm going to do with some fine seed this evening. All right. I'm going to. Um, all right. I'm going to soak some fine seed for tomorrow morning for me to have my tea. All right, because sometimes it's not every day. Sometimes I just drink something different in the morning. So what you want to do with the fine seed and just get a teaspoon of the fine seed, put into some water like this and soak it overnight. So I will soak this until tomorrow morning. All right, after tomorrow morning, we're going to make a cup of tea from this. All right, so this one, you can get it in like the health shop or some supermarket. Fine seed. Very, very good for you. All right. So this one, I'm going to be drinking it tomorrow morning when I wake up for a nice, lovely hot cup of tea right there. So tomorrow morning, I will show you exactly. I may do a short on that one and share the video with you with some ginger and a piece of a lemon. Okay, guys, let's get the, the like to 100. Thank you so much. All right. Beautiful. So what you want to do with this cup of tea, you don't want to, want to drink it too hot. Make it cool on a little bit and then you drink it. All right. And enjoy the recipe. Thank you so much, guys, for this wonderful evening. I would love to drop a cinnamon stick into it. Yeah, a cinnamon stick could do well in it. But, you know, I don't have any cinnamon stick at the moment. I run out of cinnamon stick. I'm always using cinnamon stick to in a lot of stuff. You're perfectly right. Here's the zim. Thank you so much. That tea that look nice. Thank you so much. Big up ears is him. Yes, a cinnamon stick would do really well in it. And um piece of uh, um uh what we'll call that one next now is um orange peel would do well in it also. But so it's all good, you know what I mean? We got garlic, we got the ginger and the lemon and some cloves, some um bay leaf and some um no the thing is a lot of people can't get stuff enough. And if, if you cannot get stuff, contact Chef Ricardo, man. We got a lot of things. You know what I mean? If you can't get cloves, I say, you know what I mean? I sell cloves. So if you want to order cloves from Chef Ricardo, let me know. Go over Instagram. 
messenger chef recorder how we can make you order your clothes we sell the pack of clothes you know what i mean you can get a pack of clothes for at least three pound fifty that's in english money all right so if you want to get <coughs> sorry guys is the proper is very strong if you want to get um a pack of the clothes if you can if you want to get some clothes yes because a lot of people can't get this enough so this is something where you don't want to run out of. go over to instagram and make chef record and all that all right if you can't get this one now pimento seed i mean always using pimento seed if you can't get this one get in touch with chef ricardo i can make it get it all right go over to his hello chef chef my one thing on your life uh, um hello chef oh my first time on your life okay thank you so much good evening thank you so much for coming on the live if you can't get this one pimento seed guys very good for your cooking please let me know because I have access to all of these ingredients, all right? And if you want to get these ingredients, let me know and you can get it, all right? Um, most of them they, they benefit from it. They benefit from what, the tea? Well, if you, know what, if you want to know what's the benefit of ginger or lemon and garlic, you can Google it. It's very easy. And if you Google it, it's going to give you a long list of information. I could talk to it, the information about this, could take up to three days but as i say for you it can help with a lot of stuff which is very easy like you know what i mean help to reduce information in your body that's one of the most important thing information in your body is why we are suffering that's what causes pain headache diabetes arthritis and strokes all right i have suggestion for vein vessel you have suggestion for vein vessel um like what so just I have so just I have I I can't even see on this camera right now. I need to see better better on that camera. But anyway, if you want to know anything about this recipe, please go back to Instagram. Let me know, and I can give you some more update on the on the ingredients. All right. Now, if you want to make a very simple healthy drink at home, it is simple, guys. Trust me. Turmeric, ginger, and lemon and garlic mixed together. Those three ingredients will just cleanse you up. All right. So that will just um just cleanse you the right and proper way. All right, guys. So yeah, check it out. But as I say, it's a simple, simple, simple one. All right. But anything you guys can get, just please let me know, and I will um assist you from there. Just after follow Chef Record on Instagram. And then um, I will let you know from there. I can give you the links to them if you want to buy them, where you want to do. All right. Rosemary. Yeah, I make rosemary tea all the time. I make it the other day, talking about it all the time. We're always making rosemary tea. I got like so many videos on, on YouTube about rosemary. The benefit of rosemary, what it's good for. Um, yeah. Um, two days ago, I did a tea on ripe banana. Telling you how ripe banana is very good for sleeping. That's the video I should have done tonight. But ripe banana, if you can get yourself ripe banana, if you cannot sleep at night time and you're twisting and turning, grab yourself some ripe banana and some cinnamon. And that can help you to sleep like a baby at night. If you don't believe me, try it yourself. All right? Let's grab yourself one of these right here. Organic ripe banana. All right? Cut it up, boil it off into some water with some cinnamon. And trust me, this will make you sleep like a baby. Eat one fingers of banana 15 minutes before bed and you will see the miracle what it's done for you. All right. Secondly, make a cup of tea with ripe banana and also cinnamon. No sweet, no honey, no nothing. You drink it 15 minutes before you go to bed. You sleep like a baby. When you wake up in the morning, you get a nice good eight hour rest. And if you don't sleep good, you are damaging your body, so you need to sleep good. All right? And the best way to do is to do some home remedy sometime. All right, guys? Yeah. So here it is. Banana. Can also help you to sleep. So easy recipe. All right? Um, But thank you so much for coming on the show. It is Friday evening. Guys, have a beautiful Friday evening. Look after yourself. Stay blessed. And definitely look out for more healthy recipes and more healthy lifestyle from Chef Ricardo cooking, all right? 
we will try our best to give you the world best recipes ever. And I will see you next time. Big up my YouTube channel audience. Please join my YouTube channel membership and support Chef Ricardo Cooking, guys. All right. Um, Michi Boo, thank you so much for coming on the show. I appreciate your love. And I will see you next time in the kitchen with more recipe. Have a great evening. Bye-bye.